With a variable lease, a tenant pays a specified rent increase at set future dates. The rent increases are tied to an index like the Consumer Price Index to make it fair. So let's take a look at an example exam question. Assume a building rents for $12 per square foot with an index of 1.5. The index increases to 1.8. What is the adjusted rental rate? The first thing you're going to do is write down the new index, in this case 1.8. Then you're going to write down the old index, 1.5, and you're going to divide the two to get 1.2. Then you're going to multiply that number by $12 per square foot, which is the rent that's currently being charged, to give you the new rent of $14.40 per square foot. That's all there is to it, folks. Now it's your turn, why don't you give it a try? An office rents for $5,000 a month in the first year based on an index of 60. Next year, the index increases to 63. Calculate the new monthly rent. Go ahead and hit pause and come up with your answer. When you're done, press play and we'll give you the solution. Welcome back, how'd you do? Did you get 5,250? Here's the solution. You take the new index 63, divide by the old index 60 to get 1.05, multiply that by $5,000 to get $5,250. Well, there you have it, calculating rent on a variable lease. Be sure to check out our other real estate math whiteboard videos and don't forget to hit subscribe to find out when we post more. We all